Howdy gamers, welcome to another Minecraft Xbox video where I'm going to be showing you how you can get mods on your Xbox without needing like a PC or mobile device or anything like that. Let's get straight into the tutorial. So what we're first going to do is we'll quickly install some applications onto our Xbox. So we're going to quickly boot up the Microsoft Store. So first of all, we're going to search up Internet Browser and what we're going to do is we're going to install the one that is free. You don't want to get the one that costs over ten dollars. We want to get the one that is free. So just like this, it should say install. All right. So once Internet Browser has finished installing, what we're going to do is we're going to open up the Microsoft Edge. Now, once we are here, what we're going to do is, is we are going to go to a website called mcpedl.com, just like that, right there. So we're going to go onto the website and we're going to get some stuff. I'm gonna quickly, I'm gonna get a car pack, which I'm not sure what a car pack is, I'm gonna be honest, but uh, it looks pretty interesting, I'm gonna be honest, and definitely does not even look like it's meant for my, it, it just looks nothing like Minecraft, I'm gonna be honest. But I would like to mention while I'm about, to, before I install this, m most people would like, tend to put stuff on link for ties. Now, I have a quick way to show you how to get past this. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna head to the URL, we're gonna press the three lines and we're gonna click on copy. And we're gonna go to this website called thebypasser.com, which should look a little something like this. Now a disclaimer, but be careful with, with what you do as there are ads on here and there is no way to disable them sadly. We're gonna quickly paste in the link right here and click on bypass add link not all links work for it than i expected never mind <laughs> anyway so that link should hopefully put an output link now mine unfortunately did not came up with this error code i'm still i'm not sure why but it did but anyway so i was able to get the download link so that is all good so now what we're going to do is we're, we're going to copy the link on the url here three lines click on copy we're going to head to the internet browser now and this should pop up uh, when you install it my fix to this is you just spam the two screens button a few times there we go and now we're gonna paste the link and there we go our mouse appears just like that we have to accept this there we go so now what we can do is we can click on consent and we can now install this and it should come up like this we're gonna click on save and what we're gonna do is we're going to press the two screens again go to the right and we're gonna head to downloads and there it is right there we're gonna click on the three lines again click on save as head to our downloads and click save so now that we have that installed what we're now gonna do is we're gonna head back to the microsoft edge and we're gonna head back to microsoft edge we're gonna click on a new tab uh, and we're going to get and we're gonna type in the following tinyurl.com slash file advance and we're going to press enter and it's going to say this site is trying to open the microsoft store you want to click on open do not worry i have made this link so it's completely safe and we're going to click on install we can open it it's going to say welcome to advanced file explorer version 2 we're going to just click on close and right, we're going to click on the bookshelf right here and click on downloads now this is where we should have all of our downloads so what we're going to do is, is the one we downloaded was F1 2022. We're going to copy it. We can obviously cut it, but I like to copy it just in case. And then we're going to click on the star and then local. And then we're going to go to packages. And we want to find a folder called Microsoft.Minecraft, just like this right here. Now, I do want to mention, not everyone is going to have this folder. If you don't have it, I put a, I'll put a video in the description on how you can get this folder all you want to do is you want to click on microsoft or minecraft local state games com.mojang and you and you should see a bunch of folders the main ones we, we want to have is behavior pack minecraft worlds resource packs skin packs those are the main ones that we want to have uh, and then we're going to pop it into our selected folder so we'll do resource pack and there we go there is right there <laughs> one of our another add-ons we're gonna get a skin pack as well so let's head back to the microsoft edge and we're going to not need that tab but we're gonna need this tab all right so we're gonna do download all right so all we have to do is copy that is paste it oh no oh yeah there's an ad all right we're gonna paste it and we're gonna click on bypass add link and there we go here it is media file link all right so we can click on that 
And oh no, don't do not want to click on that. And that's not what we want to click on. If it says media file, you want to make sure that, that the URL says mediafile.com and that there's like some sort of UI that looks something like this. So, right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to copy this link and we're going to head back to internet browser. Oh, hey, finished downloading. All right, and we're going to press two, two screens and then we're going to do three lines, paste, A, enter all three lines uh, and then download we save press the two screens again all the way to the three dots downloads uh, save as then you want to head to your downloads and put the folder all right now that i have what i need <laughs> we're gonna close out of everything so microsoft edge and all that jazz and we're gonna head to the microsoft store now which is where we're going to install our final thing all right so we're going to type in minecraft deluxe and it should come up with this right here so we're gonna well, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna scroll all the way down to, until we have add-ons for this game so there's there are a lot of add-ons now most of these should have the other version of minecraft which is what we're gonna get so i'll just click on Oh, I don't know, Minecraft DuckTales, why not? So we're going to scroll down, and it should say it works with, and it should be three Minecrafts, Minecraft Preview, Minecraft with Game Pass, and Minecraft. We want to get the one that does not have the Game Pass symbol right there. I should say install. Now, if it does say not currently available, then I don't think there is a fix for this. I'll see if there is. If you don't have the old version, or the other version then unfortunately uh at the moment it will not work so 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 i do really apologize for this anyway so for the people that do have the install button let's move on if if you do have a friend or someone you know that does have this version of minecraft see if you can like game share with them i'll explain what that means they're basically it's where they give you your their account and you can make it your home xbox and then you can install it just be careful with who you're doing it with because they could be very shady so i would like to mention that i don't recommend doing it but it's possible all right so once it's installed we want to click on it and it should say minecraft needs an update if it does say minecraft needs an update then that's good that's a good sign i did read some comments and in, in my previous video and some said that oh my minecraft didn't need an update Oh, what just happened? What you have to do is, is you have to ins uninstall the current version of Minecraft you have. So, what we're going to do is, on here, we're going to just do uninstall all. Just like that. Do not worry, your save data will still be there in fine. The only way your save data can go is if you can if you delete that button. Let's not talk about that button. Now what we can do is, is we can update the game. And hopefully that shouldn't happen again. It doesn't happen! Let's go! Not much will change, except for your game's settings will reset. I have heard that some of your worlds break. I'll double check that. Okay, so mine hasn't. So we're gonna check if my skins were there. So I installed a... Here we go, Steve and Alex hold in said amount of block. I'll do Steve holding among us, because it's funny. Alright, and... Here we are. We are in a world with the custom skin I downloaded. It's so unfortunately not with the car, though. I don't know, don't know what happened to that car, but yeah, anyway. It, it works fine we'll see if the mod i put in does work and yes it does it still works i'm not i'm actually kind of surprised <laughs> so we can we'll just try some of these out i haven't tried all of them i don't know if they're there all right let's just test anyway doesn't matter oh oh my god they got yeeted <laughs> holy all right let's uh let's try the warden Take that iron golem, haha. <laughs> Won't be able to kill me now. <laughs> I'm invisible. Oh wait, I just realized these um these these ninja things, they like they like throw on they're, they're onto the ground. Oh that's sick, I never realized that. Anyway, with all of that being said, my name is, is Sam or cool Sam999 and hope you have a lovely day, evening, and night, and I'm out.